and thanks for joining me for another shave. It's Movember, but I'm doing something different this year and I'll get into why as we shave. What we shave with, as you can tell from the thumbnail, we're using Noble Otter Firefighter, a fantastic fall scent. It is beautiful. A unique blend. And the notes in this are grapefruit, lavender, red cedar wood, water, sandalwood, and ambergris. I don't get any grapefruit, but I do get the lavender, which is a nice, calming, warm scent. And I get the wood and the ambergris. It's beautiful. And there's the pot, it's brand new. I haven't used it yet. Right, razor we're using is on loan from a, a very kind subscriber and friend of the channel, Paul Kuhn. How you doing, Paul? Thank you so much for your kindness, mate. And it is the Yaki Tile Razor. I've never used this very Henson like head. I've heard good things about it though, and I believe this is the bolt handle made of 316 stainless steel. Nice weight to it, I don't know what it weighs. Shortish handle, what's that, about three and a half inches? Nice bit of grip there, spiral, not spiral, circular. I'm looking forward to it. And inside there today, we are going to be using A vintage blade. It's a stainless supreme perma sharp, kindly gifted to me by Kevy Shaves. Thanks, Kevy. So I'm just gonna load the blade. I'll just show you the base cap. Nice lather channels. Nice, nicely machined. To be honest with you, I love when you can see the machine marks on it. Makes it unique. It's not. One other razor will be like it. Made in Great Britain, these blades, as you can see. Single wrap. Nicely stamped as well. I think I've used one of these before. And it was a really nice blade. You can tell the vintage with all the detail on it. There you go. We'll pop that on the head plate there goes the base we'll just screw that on there really looking forward to this shave and don't worry Paul that everything will be sterilised and sent back to you but feel free to sterilise them yourself for your own peace of mind no overhang on this razor whatsoever Blade alignment. There's not a lot of exposure there. I don't know if you can see that on camera. It doesn't look it to me. But I believe it's a very efficient razor. And he sent me a few razors um, to try. And a couple of yakis. And come in these cases. These are a fantastic idea. Makes a great travel razor. Bit of velcro there to protect and you've got the the elastic here for your handle and then you've got the elastic there for your for your plate absolutely great idea i love these i'll leave a link in the description to yaki if i can <laughs> brush i'm going to be whipping well gathering the lather up with is my Yaki 24mm synthetic deep stone. Absolutely love the design of this handle. Absolutely beautiful. Right, I forgot to put water in the bowl. So I'll just get that going, get the brush in. Yeah, Movember. I am not growing anything. Um, normally in Movember, us guys. 
YouTubers grow a goatee moustache or a beard or anything like that for prostate cancer. But I do it for all cancers. I um, I donate weekly. I have a percentage out of my wage going to Cancer Research UK. And I give a um, like a one-off donation to the hospital that looked after my mother um, when she had the cancer. Oh God, I love this label. Beautiful scent. Free flick so it's wet but not dripping. Let's just gather this off the puck and see where we go. Yeah, I donate regular and um, I almost donate every day. For those who don't know, I'm a postman for Royal Mail, have, have been for the last 20 years. And I find money on the floor as I'm on delivery. And what I do is, I do a collection at a post office and they have charity boxes. And every bit of money, every week that I find on the floor, I collect and I donate, I put it in the box. And the box is actually for the hospital where my mother was being treated and looked after when she had cancer. Sadly, she passed away. And it's a horrible thing, cancer. I mean, let's face it. If not every single one of us has been affected in some shape or form, whether it be a loved one, a friend, a work colleague, yourself, we've all been affected by it in one way or another. I'm going to go with that. That looks lovely. Looking forward to this. Right, let's wet the face and get lathering up. See where we go with this. Just adjust a minute. Oh, I'm getting a lot, getting a lot of cedar. Just drop, drop the glove up. The leather in the ball. Should be enough for three passes, but if not. We can go back to the park. I'm sorry if this goes on a bit long. I'm extremely tired. Work is getting horrendous. Now it's coming towards Christmas. I love the feel on the skin with uh, Noble Otter. It's beautiful. Water out. Yeah, we've all been affected in some way. I. Personally, I've had two cancer scares of the esophagus. Uh, Mrs. B has had um, a scare of cancer of the tongue, and she's had a piece, she had like a, a triangle piece of the tongue cut out for um, biopsy. Thankfully, it was, it was negative. So yeah, it's, it's a horrible thing, and the, the worst thing I hate about cancer There's no symptoms or no pain or anything until it's too late, usually. Right, here we go, guys. First pass. With the Yaki and the Vintage Perma Sharp. It's very smooth. I can just about feel the blade, and I can just about hear it as well. Yeah. So, November. I did November once, and I hated it, guys. It it, it really surprised how much it affected me. Not shaving the whole face. It was for a good cause, I know. Wow, that feels nice. Okay. 
I said I wouldn't do it again. I probably will do it at some point, but but I've got a story to tell you. Last month I signed up for doing a fundraiser with Cancer Research UK. And I was supposed to be doing a hundred press ups a day for the whole of November. There's no way I can do a hundred press ups in a day, but you could split it up to like five sets of 20 through the day. I thought I'll do that, no, not a problem. But I started training in October, mid October, for the challenge and the fundraiser. Unfortunately, I put it down to age. <laughs> I aggravated an old injury in my shoulder that I had when I was younger. I had capsulitis. I, um, I actually tore the muscle off the bone. So I aggravated it. I went to the doctors. And I've been on painkillers and anti-inflammatories. It's a lot better than what it was, but I've de developed quite a lump on my shoulders up here. And um, I've got to go back to the doctors and, and I might have to get a biopsy on that or see what it says what it is, see if I can get it removed. It's more uncomfortable. Anyway. He recommended that I couldn't do it. There's no way I can put that much pressure on my own body weight with press ups. And I was absolutely gutted. Because I was already signed up for the challenge. So I had an idea. What I'll do shave my head. Now I do shave my head now and again but it's mainly in the summer when it's warm because I work outdoors. Oh this is great. Excellent cushion. Excellent cushion. This soap. Anyway so I have an idea to keep my head shaved for the rest of November. I wanted to start it last week. But because of my shoulder, I could move it and I could use it and everything, but I couldn't raise it above my head for the shave. I mean, even now it's uncomfortable. But the next video you'll see is a head shave. And I'm gonna keep it shaved for the rest of November for the cancer awareness, for all cancers, not just men's prostrate. And what I'll do is, I will put a link direct to the Cancer Research Fund in the description for the rest of November. And it doesn't come to me, it doesn't go through me, it goes straight to the um, foundation. So if you click on more where the title is, it'll drop the page and it, it'll be there. So, oh, right, enjoy this. Nice and relaxed, second pass, there we go. I'm quite impressed with this uh, tile razor. The thing I find with these style of heads, like the Henson, the Winning Razor, and the Tile, it's quite hard to maintain, probably until you get used to it, to dial in the angle, even though the head is designed to find it for you.
but I must admit that blade exposure it's very comfortable I would say the feel in the hand of this razor and the feel on the face it feels more of an expensive razor a more higher end great for getting up to the nostril so that's what I'm going to do that's my bit so instead of growing something I'm going to get rid of something but the, the video I'm hoping it's going to be Friday I couldn't do it with the injury last week. The video will be different. Because it's going to be the whole thing. It's going to be from the buzz cut to the head shave. So I'll, I'll pre-warn you now, it might be a long video, but you can always skip it to the bits you want to see. This is beautiful, guys. Wow. I'm quite impressed with this razor. Yeah, the blade. You made up with the blade. Um, I believe that they were made in Glasgow. Or thereabouts. I'm enjoying the post shave feel off this soap as well. Skin feels hydrated and soft. I'll leave a link into this as well. It's like boys. How you doing, Finn? If you're watching this. Guys, money pass, my favourite pass against the Grove. Yeah, so all this mess will be gone on Friday, hopefully. So how are you guys doing okay? You've been having a good week so far? I hope so. Keep the shows coming in the comments as well and keep your comments coming guys and thank you so much for the thumbs up. Very much appreciate it. I never take for granted what I've got regarding the channel. I've made some fantastic friends. I've had the pleasure of borrowing and experiencing new gear. I've had the pr privilege of purchasing things off you guys that I wouldn't normally be able to. And it's just the support. Very overwhelming. But it's like everything else, especially cancer, we need to support people and each other. And it can be very hard, I know that from experience. It's hard to take everything in. And still be strong for that special person. Great feedback. I don't know if you can feel it. Uh, feel it. <laughs> oh, here we go. I don't know if you can hear that.
Yeah, I'll leave a link into the cancer research. Just in case you want to make a donation, it, you don't have to. I'm not asking you to. It's there if you want to. God, there's barely any pickups, just a very little just there. That's a fantastic shave. I'm very impressed, Paul. Thank you so much. And I can't wait to try the other one. Or the other two. Yeah, just here. Wow. No Balotta always delivers. I believe this started, I don't know if it still is, but I believe this started out as a charitable soap. All proceeds, or some of the proceeds went to uh, the firefighters, I think it was South America. I'm not sure it's bushfires or something. Wildfires, here we go, pick up time. Another very noble cause. Wow. Do, do you know... <sighs> you know it's close when you get to the pickups and everything and there's nothing there. You know it's a good shave. Yeah, so the next video you will see, and if you haven't already, Hit that notification bell icon so you don't miss any uploads. It'll, it'll be a full buzz cut and head shave and I'm gonna keep it shaved for the rest of November. So I'm not gonna win anything and get rid of something. Which is what it's all about with cancer. Get rid of it. Right, cold water it. Right, here we go, here's the test of the album. Not a thing. Wow, I'm impressed with that razor. I don't know how much it costs or, or anything. Wow, I think I'm going to have to get one. I'm impressed with that. Nothing like a great shave to put you in a good mood. Not that I was in a bad mood. Just tired. With work. Wow. Here's the result. Happy jappy. Splash. Matching splash. It's got to be the matching splash. Fantastic label. I love no water labels, especially the limited edition or special edition ones. Scent strength of the soap, I'd put it about five. I get more of the blend. There's nothing I can pick out specific with the splash, it's more of a blend. It's masculine. Wow, that is masculine, I just got like an extra whiff of it. Masculine blend. It's beautiful. Boom. I'm going with rock face, all weather, now that the weather's turning, and it is turning. The, I think the Indian summer that we've been having has finally left us. I was on a delivery, I got moved on to my fa favourite delivery, up in the sticks, Clenarman. Not far from here, where I live. Favourite delivery, the scenery and the, the wildlife is absolutely fantastic. 
The rain was going sideways. <laughs> it was windy, it was rainy, it was heavy. Slight, slight scent to this. I can't put my finger on it, what it smells like, but it's good stuff. Yeah, so the weather's changed here. We, we had our first frost. When was it? What day was I off? Last Friday, last Friday, it's, it's quite a heavy frost in the morning. Not had one since, but it's been very cold and the temperature dropped quite early in the, in the evening. But yeah, so, you know, it is what it is. We're November, but we've been lucky. Right, that's it. Thank you so much for joining me, guys. Don't forget to check the, um, the description for the um, Cancer Research Fund. And uh, yeah. I'll see you on the um, the full Monty. Take care of yourself, guys, and take care of each other. I'll see you soon. Stay smooth and stay safe. Bye now.